Vanessa, well, continuing with our trek and adventures into the winemaking techniques. Yes. We are heading all the way to Burgundy. This is a Cote de Nuit producer, Patrice Rion, which um, focuses on this, uh, or focus to bring it into the club. It's a little bit of a whole cluster. Ah, uh, okay, yes. Often used on Pinot Noir and uh -huh. Syrah, but, um, but definitely a, a sort of winemaker's trick to, um, to add um, sort of a brighter floral aromas, sometimes like an herbal lift uh, to the wine as well. Exactly, and, and for our viewers, like what do you, what's your take on, on, on it? On... Whole cluster, it's like, um, it, it's like a, a, a spice, you know, you can use a lot of it in dish, you can use a lot of whole cluster or a little bit, but basically, you know, when we, meet, when we say whole cluster, we mean that the, the grapes were not destemmed. So the winemaker can, you know, throw whole clusters right into the fermenter um, and the, the inclusion of the stems, you know, it does a couple things that during fermentation, it can actually sort of aid drainage in the tank um, when you're doing like your, your you know, your pump overs. Um, but again, that the, the stems can add this sort of like aromatic lift. Yeah. Um, and then, you know, in some cases, if, if it's if it's really um, a uh, whole berry, you know, um, whole cluster, you can actually have some, a bit of carbonic uh -huh. maturation as well, cool. which, you know, the intracellular fermentation. Absolutely. So. This is a beautiful example. I think it definitely sim signifies what you're talking about. Yeah. And it brings out this le levels of spice. You get that beautiful perfume lift on totally. this. Totally, a little bit of cola. And I think it's, I think it's beautifully done because in some wines, I think, you know, 100% whole cluster um, is too much. But for this, it's just the right amount to add a bit of complexity to the wine. Totally, it just brings a little zing to the ballerina dancing. It's really pretty. She had a cup of coffee before she stepped Ex onto that stage. <laughs> a, a strong coffee. <laughs> um, <laughs> what would you pair this with? Wow, uh, talk about pairings. I mean, uh, maybe some grilled octopus with Ooh, some like uh, a little nice. paprika spice yeah. and some potatoes. Uh, that would bring a little lift to it and, and kind of embrace right. the the acidity? How I about think you? At any kind of like game I think would be uh -huh. lovely with this, but anything with mushrooms too. I mean, Ooh. I think you could do like a fresh mushroom pasta. Uh-huh, like yeah. a thick cut pappardelle, oh, yeah. like braised. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. It's delicious. All day, this is definitely quite a treat. Cheers. Cheers.